Garcia is making a comeback from his hiatus due to mental illness. Let's talk. A straighter, yep, not yep. a roundhouse right hand. And that's what we've been talking about—the straight shot, exactly. the one where he gets leverage on it. I don't want to kill Pull somebody back for a, a little bit. Seconds. Nah, I want a body on my record. Now I want to see you fight, motherfuckers. I do. All right, I'm with you. I'm with you as long as as long as you're trying to fight the great, the, your, or the, the the best competition. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to bury you alive. I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we are here. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to bury you alive. I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we are here. Fight the best if you ain't with the moto. Just click the link, bitch, and get buried like the rest. It ain't gonna work how you want it. These trolls already tried, too many come but don't leave. So if you're here, you gotta die. Spitting straight facts. These bitches cry cause they hate that. The LDBC's the top topic, bitch. Hate that. Be the best to bring the truth to these fans. So why you hate? I'm gonna laugh and keep counting these bands. Come to the graveyard. Click the link, get the bands. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard. So Ryan Garcia, after um, his miraculous cure of like being gone for two weeks. <laughs> After living with the lifelong pain and struggle of mental illness, um, after living with it for so long, you know, that he couldn't get no fight with anybody, you know, after living with the mental illness, um, the pain and anguish where he lied and said that the only fight he wants is to fight Tank Davis. That's all he wants. And he's going to knock him out in two rounds. Um, the whole world's seen it now. You can't pull out. You can't back out now. The whole world seen that you're fighting me and I'm knocking you out in two rounds. You know, the clout, the 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 clout chasing, the mental illness clout chasing of Ryan Garcia um kicked in. And then he and then mysteriously he was fighting Manny Pacquiao. <laughs> and it's not an exhibition, it's a real fight. Um it's on. It's my dream fight. You know, well, you know, uh who wouldn't turn down um Tank Davis to fight? Manny Pacquiao. This is Pacquiao. You know, so, yeah, I mean, it's not like I'm running and hiding or ducking ter uh, Manny Pacquiao. I ain't ducking Pacquiao. I mean, ducking uh, Tank Davis. This is Pacquiao I'm fighting. I ain't ducking Tank Davis. Uh, I'm knock Tank Davis out in two rounds. So after I get, you know, this is the dream fight that I've been dreaming about my whole life, and I finally got it, and I'm so happy. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to take, I'm fighting Pacquiao, and then after the Pacquiao fight, I'll come back around, and I'll still knock Tank Davis out in two rounds. Until Manny Pacquiao said you're full of shit. Do, 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 do. You're uh, uh, full of shit. Do, 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 do. After Manny Pacquiao said that, then all of a sudden, uh, well, you know, I I never I never really said um, that the fight was um, going to happen. It was just something that, you know, I dreamed about, and it was uh, all a dream. It was all a dream uh, after that. So why didn't you go back to the Tank Davis fight? If the Manny Pacquiao fight was a dream, why didn't you go back to the Tank Davis fight? It was still there. Tank was like, hey, well, you know, uh, I'm going to knock this man's head off because you know. But why didn't you go back to Tank? He didn't go nowhere. He was still there. <laughs> why didn't Lion Ryan go back to Tank Davis? In the fight that you said you're going to knock this man out in two rounds, why didn't you go back to that? Mental illness? So were you mentally ill before or after you told the world you're fighting Tank Davis and you're knocking him out in two rounds? Was it mental illness that made you do that in the first place? I'm just asking. Because you literally fought no one. 
the people still believed that you're going to knock out Tang Davis in two rounds. <laughs> even after getting dropped by Campbell, by Luke Skywalker, even after getting dropped by Luke Skywalker, people still said, Oh, well, BFTB, you don't know shit about boxing. Like Floyd Mayweather daddy say, you don't know shit about boxing because Lion Ryan's going to knock Tank Davis out. Just watch, you'll see. He's got 7 million followers on IG, and that tells you it all. So, I don't give a fuck how many people's following him. What the fuck does that mean? Is that part of the mental illness shit? From Lion Ryan, is that part of the mental illness shit? Or, or, or was it part of the mental illness stuff, the, the, the part where you said, you're fighting tank, uh, Devin Haney. Yeah, I'm. Uh, listen, uh, listen. De uh, I'm gonna fight Devin Haney. You know that's the fight. You know, um, but you know I'm gonna fight everybody else first. You know I'm gonna fight Tank. I'm gonna fight Jesus, Moses, Allah, Muhammad, the Boogeyman. You know I'm gonna fight Charlie's Angels, and then after I finish all that, then I'll fight Devin Haney because you know then you know the fight will be big enough. Then the fight will be big enough after Luke, Luke Sneezy, John, Paul, Jake. And Juke, the fight will be big enough then, and then I'll fight Devin Haney, and then I'll knock him out. <laughs> is that mental illness? This man's mental illness is capery. There is no cure for it. There's no cure. There's no cure for this man's mental illness. It is called capery. Capery. You you fight to become the interim. WBC champion, and then you say that Devin Haney, the real WBC champion, is a fake. He's not the real. You're the champ. <laughs> so you're the champ. So Devin got a fake belt. You got the real belt. But yours is the interim belt. His is the re his is the actual world title belt. You are the interim champion, meaning you are his mandatory. So instead of fighting him to clear up that issue, you. Say you're mental ill and that's it. I'm mentally ill, so you know I'm not. I'm mentally ill, so you have the sanctioned body says I'm the interim champion, but I'm mentally ill, so I'm just not gonna fight for the belt. I'm mentally ill. And I'm bigger than Devin. I'm bigger than you know, and it's the four horsemen, and I'm part of the four. You ain't part of shit, nigga. You ain't part of nothing. Ryan Garcia is not a part of no fucking four horsemen. You that's who pe the people that are saying that are on mental illness themselves. They're on. They're mentally ill themselves. Javier Fortuna has a better shot at being part of the Four Horsemen than Lion Ryan. You've beaten no one. You've done nothing, bro. Literally nothing. You're you you are about to fucking bust a nut after uh fighting Luke Skywalker, the guy that Devin Haney was supposed to fight, that the WBC wouldn't sanction, the guy that then lost to Lomachenko. The guy that floored you. How come no one's saying a Lion Ryan is chinny? I'm just asking. Where where is everybody saying that Lion Ryan is chinny? Jorge Linares beat the shit out of a uh, 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 fucking Campbell. Beat the brakes off his ass. So how come no one is saying that Ry Lion Ryan is chinny when Luke Skywalker dropped him? How, why isn't Tiafimo Lopez? I mean, why isn't Vasily Lomachenko or Lion Ryan Chinny? They both got dropped. Both of them got dropped. Why aren't they Chinny? Uh, but Devin Haney's Chinny. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mental illness. <laughs> yeah, that, that's mental illness. That's mental illness. Lion Ryan gets dropped by Luke Skywalker. But Devin Haney is Chinny because Devin Haney gets rocked by the guy who beat the shit out of Luke Skywalker. Mental illness. <laughs> so then the man says uh, the WBC does him another favor. They do him another solid. Okay, well, you know, Lion Ryan, what we're going to do because you have 7 million followers or 10,000 billion followers on IG and Twitter, what we're going to do is we're just going to make you the mandatory, but you just got to be Javier for Tuna Fish, and then you'll be the mandatory to Devin Haney. That's all you got to do. Just be him. Again, no Tank Davis now. You just throw Tank Davis completely out the window. Okay, well, I'm going to fight Javier Fortuna and then Devin, boy, I'm coming. After I fight Javier Fortuna, I'm coming for you, boy, I'm coming. And then Javier Fortuna says, uh, I, yes, uh, fight Ryan, great. Nigga's like, 
That nigga Lion Ryan was like, what? What you say? All right, I got mental illness. I ain't fighting this man either, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He he can't even speak full English, man. I ain't fighting this man. Nah, because people that can't speak full English, you know, they're, they don't, people that can't speak full English will never have as many Twitter followers and Instagram followers as I have. So he doesn't deserve to fight me. So I'm, I'm just, listen, bro, I got mental illness. I got mental illness. So, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this one up. Uh, take vacation and shit. And then the public's like, oh gosh, it's okay, Lion Ryan. You know, we understand, you know, mental illness is so, such a hard thing to get over. It's such a, it, you know, we never know. You can't really, you can't really um, figure out the, the, the cure and the justifications and, and the pain and the suffering that someone has to go through with the mental illness that you have. And it, I understand it's okay. Then he goes on vacation with a bunch of bitches, surfing and type of shit like that. No hospital, nothing. Just go on vacation with bitches. Come back after Javier Fortuna is fighting Jojo Diaz uh, instead of fighting you. As soon as that fight gets announced, all of a sudden, shit, I'm, hey man, I'm, listen, making my comeback, I'm cured. <laughs> cured in the motherfucking bro. Still no Tank Davis though. Still no Tank Davis in two rounds, but you know, I'm cured. You know, shit, man. Uh, that that motherfucking them bitches and that and them 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 that water, them bitches and them that vacation, man. That just that just did me right, bro. I, I'm I'm listen, bro. I'm gonna do these videos to everybody, let everybody know. You know, mental illness is no joke. And you know, I'm, I'm coming back. You know, I'm back now. You know, wish me well. Godspeed, <laughs> man. Get the fuck out of here, lion Ryan. Who the fuck you think you fooling, nigga? You ain't fooling me. Yeah, you might be fooling somebody. You ain't fooling me. All right, because I know motherfuckers who have mental illness. You just don't snap out of it like that. You don't just have it and then mysteriously you're cured. Get the fuck out of here. It's like getting in a car crash and saying you got whiplash so you can get paid. Motherfucker says, hey, does this hurt? Yes. Does that hurt? Yes. Does this hurt? Yes. Okay, you got whiplash. Get a paycheck. That is what Ryan Garcia is doing. Oh, shit, I got to fight who? Devin? Oh, man, mental illness. Oh, I got to fight who? Javier Fortuna? Oh, shit, mental illness. Yeah, hey, man, I can't. I can't. These guys don't have enough social media followers as me anyway, so, you know, I can't fight them because mental illness. Get the fuck out of here. This dude's pussy, bro. You just don't want to fight these guys. Period. You do not want to fight them. You know you get fucked up badly because you can't fight. You fight a fucking giraffe. Now, you can punch. Absolutely can punch. You fight. Your defense is garbage. You keep your head straight up in the air. You fight just like a giraffe. You are glutton for a destructive knockout punch by from Devin Haney, from Tank Davis. You are glutton for it. You ain't beating no, none of these guys. You get destroyed by all of them. You are not the you are not part of the four horse four horsemen at all. If matter of fact, you are. You are part of the four horsemen. You are the one, you are the jockey that cleans cleans up the horse's shit. That's what you are. You have the three horsemen walking around, and you walk behind them to clean up their shit. That is the closest you're going to get to being a fourth horseman. BFTB. Shout out to the LDBC. And I'm out.